municipalities considering upgrading their energy infrastructure should start by looking in their own backyard. The town of Tallinn made their project more successful by utilizing the expertise of local business owner and chair of the Energy Task Force, Mark Summers. Many communities are now forming energy task force of, of some sort to look at all the various forms of alternate sources of energy, whether it be solar, wind, geothermal, etc. This uh, geothermal project is really a comprehensive replacement of our entire HVAC system in our town hall building. And we have known for a number of years that our system was antiquated and needed a replacement. So the primary focus was on the replacement of all the heat pumps in the building, uh, the duct work, and then there was consideration as to whether we replace the boiler system or look at some alternate source of, of energy, using the public to help support you in terms of the analysis and ultimately uh, your discussions with the public are, are invaluable. I'm a member of the Energy Task Force. I've been the chair for uh, about four years, which is how long the task force has been in existence. And our role, which is to study the building and, and make recommendations on how the building could be more efficient. At the end of the study, we decided that geothermal was the best option and would provide the uh, least expensive method to heat and cool the building for a long time. There was a look at use of gas, which we don't have the option here in Tallinn because we don't have the lines running through town. Greater use of solar was looked at, but in terms of the location of this particular building, it wasn't thought to be something that would be practical. We then went forward with the project because we felt there was a reasonable payback period of about 10 to 15 years in order to uh, uh, pay back our investment. Right now we're anticipating about a $40,000 a year savings in fuel, um, a slight increase in electrical costs. Mark Summers was extremely important in terms of guiding the commission through the various analysis. Somebody who understood the data that was being presented and could explain it back to the general public in a way that they could understand all the, the technical terms and having somebody who had actually gone through the experience of converting his own private business to a geothermal-based system with a demonstrated success, we didn't have to go miles away to find another uh, entity where it had been successful. We had one in our own backyard. We've got a few heat pumps that are part of the geothermal system. There's about uh, 30 or so heat pumps that look like that. They don't look like anything special. Metal boxes, but inside the uh, the heat pump is a uh, compressor similar to what you have in your refrigerator and that's the business end of the geothermal system. Having a champion like Mark Summers continues to help the town of Tallinn become more energy efficient. In addition, Mark leads by example every day with his commitment to sustainability. Really the philosophy behind the sustainability measures are to reduce our energy footprint, to use less energy and to lower our costs as well. In addition, we like to set the tone. We like to let people know that we care about the environment, that uh, we're aware there's energy problems in the world, and we're doing something about it because we can.